It's getting out of their shell a little bit. And speaking of, uh oh, get to hop on board. We see how strong these legs are. As he goes over the top of the boiler, but Tig is there. What a flick and what a shot. Finds the first, and LG, they pick up right where they left off. They had a bit of freeze time, Wes. 20 minutes between games. And they come in fire hot here on the pistol. Sharp as ever, as if they never took the break. So good from Luminosity. And yeah, these these A hits, they're taking a little bit of a page out of Knight's book here with that push up mid. They do manage to get some really, really nice stuff, especially Tig, like you say, that headhunter coming to in very, very close. Last round for Moose here. But the timing. There we go. Headshot goes in. Nice job there for Moose to find the stabilize. Takes out the opposing duelist. And now that's going to signal them to head back towards A with Tig finding another one. Five versus three. On well, left. are they heading back to A? Because <laughs> yeah. they've got a guy over on B and well, they just got a kill there. So maybe there's still B. The rotation does come through and Randy Savage is able to find one kill, but it's only one on the round, not before being answered by Moose. Ooh, it's retro. Crispy one tap there. The Vandal doing heaps of damage. Unfortunately, has three players to worry about and is running out of time with that spike being planted. You don't have a whole lot to play with. You don't really have to worry about the teleports anymore, fortunately, because Tig is dead. Mata is dead as well, but Dazzle. See gaming as well, so we'll see how those uh, Vipers come into play this round. There we go. Oh, man. I mean, you almost called it perfectly. Oh. If Moose was able to get something there, that would have been huge, but Mata... Pays the price. Now the new ice box, you can't shoot through that box any longer. So Dazzle, free for the plant. And here we go, 3v3. This Renegades, again, last hope here. You lose here, you're back on that reset. Tig almost got more too. That trigger discipline almost paid off in spades. You know, just the timing, just off not to take out Lin. But still, Lin is in a very, very tough spot here. Up close and personal with the operator, Dazzle. Here with the Soba. Actually, that's a nice push from Roy, but it's only B-Dog. Only B-Dog. We say only B-Dog, but he's doing only just enough here. Low HP on Lin, and you said I'm close and personal. It doesn't get more oh. up close than this. This B-Dog closes out. And this slow default from Luminosity Gaming is working out in a lot of cases. Here's, ooh, there's Lin. Slowly starting to creep on up. Knives just around the corner. Dazzle's done it before. Can he do it again? No, he can has been deadly so far, and this is what you need to look for over on the side of Renegades. Lin, a relatively new addition to the team, and they've added him as, you know, the main jet player, the opper, the fragger. He needs to put in work. Oof. Thank you, doing it. The force fourth on the round doesn't need it. Full A hit here. Death ball coming in. Oh, And in close to death was Tig. Mata pops the imprint. Empress pushes onto the site, but immediately taken down. Randy Savage is able to find one as well in the full rotation. Now coming on through as the Vipers pit cuts off the sight lines and Moose holds the high ground. It's LG down a player in Renegades. Trying to find their way into the site. Oh, I thought Moose maybe saw one. It seems like the kills are escaping. As Roy goes across the ropes, Moose is able to take him down. And now Renegades starting to get cut down piece by piece as Dazzle will find the next Sapoth. Pushes into the pit. I think the operator might just back away. The high ground is just so strong. That's what we learned in Star Wars. Lin won't land the next shot. I mean, he doesn't need much. Oh. It could be through 10. It's tough. You tag up the Reyna, and you cannot, at this point, let Mata get anything. Or else that Reyna will be full health and overhealed. As Dazzle forced to back away. Here comes the Hunter's Fury. Trying to slow down and delay the plant. But there's so much time on the clock. It's only... Going to allow for rotation to buy a bit more for once that spike does get planted. The position, of course, they pretty much knew how to get back in. Spike is just unreachable right now unless Mata gets something ridiculous here. Nope. Not likely. And a bit more firepower behind it. The last time we saw the lockdown, then of the sword, it, it doesn't really make sense. While all this is happening, though... Mm -hmm. The spike is planted. It crept all the way up into Nest. Is able to get back to that rendezvous and get out of dodge. And once more, we see LG playing that post plant. And I love this that they're having Tig kind of be that planter because he can get out and play so far off yeah. the site. That's exactly where they want to be. Is Mata the only one playing aggressive for now? Picks up Roy to try to push on through. Lockdown could be made quick work of. No, instead, Dazzle just continues to headhunt. 
with that Hunter series. We continue to go back and forth play. all. Oh, the attackers pushed off to the side. Mata gonna be taken down, detained, I think, for the bait, but nobody was there to answer back. Now Tig has to do it as they're on the spike. The shot will land. No way. What? He does it again. Touch with four. Uh, he's wide open right now, but. I'm just gonna hold this angle. Doesn't want to spray through the wall just yet. Doesn't want to give away his position. So instead, Tig will do so. Force Retro into a bad spot. And there's the secure mm -hmm. on the kill. But here comes Lin. He's been good with the operator before. Can he do it again as Tig goes up and over the top? Once more, we're seeing it. Looking to get that spike down. Oh! That run. They no spike way. The near okay. sight. And Lin is still able to find the kill through it. Now the spike down in a precarious position is randy savage low hp only takes a couple of shoulder shots to sit him down and well the rest of the bodies are starting to fall apoc has big shoes to fill here in this one his model looks to get that spike planted in that same position and closes that back to the sheriff i've been doing a good bit of damage now they're wary of one i believe out towards mid as well the trademark was destroyed but this is another situation where renegades well, we've seen him pick up a thrifty round but so much momentum for Luminosity, Lin, again, has the, the largest shoes to fill with the blades online, and he's not really in a position to do so. We go back and forth just a bit. The health bar is getting low on the side of Renegades. Empress available, but I don't think there's a weapon in hand. And here we go. Here's the flank. Beat up. No way. The knives, they all go wide. The classic what? won't come out in time. Yes, it will. And we find ourselves in a 1v1. But again, the weaponry, it's not great. It's just a sheriff. So Retro has no use here. For that Empress, but might just have enough time. We'll find the He's got it. Down to the He's got it. And Renegades have done it. Tanner. It, it doesn't seem to slow anything nope. down. It doesn't seem to slow. In a little bit here, our Luminosity. A player ahead. Oh, and Retro doesn't find anything. They line up and it does damage, but unfortunately, just not enough to find the kills. Mata swings on through. Roy, the next to have to answer to the Reyna. And Things just don't go his way. Randy Savage, however, has been strong here in the defense. Not strong enough to find the next couple of kills. And no way. I mean, this is just not real. Dazzle has been so perfect. Lin, that was players uh, around the Valorant sphere. And, and they do enter. They do need to move. B is going to be the play. And they are facing into one player. But if this there's any delay. Okay, so Dazzle gets traded. That's definitely an excellent development. That means that plant is free. And Renegades tried to resell that. They could quite possibly try to hit A. Still available. Last Thing absolutely game. rips. Now the last one standing as he's got one round left. Rendezvous available. I'm not too sure if he's got the teleport set up in a position. It only takes a body shot here to find Roy. Then we'll have to swap over to the classic and unfortunately that goes wide. It's TIG against the world. It's TIG against the clock and two. It's Roy, I mean, Roy likes to play games with Tiggs, apparently. With the, the way that he's jumping up when he's got the Tour de Force. He's playing with them here out towards B-Long. Just having a good time. Getting time off the clock. Most some fashion talk into the A hit, which is all five here. Once again, RNG grouping up. And the near side on the Leer slows things down for information that can be garnered by that Owl drone. And it pays huge dividends. That Leer does so much for Mata here in this round. Also picking up two kills as well. They're really starting to come back to form now that they have weapons in hand. And I don't want this to be it, but this could be it all. Around the corner, mm. waiting to find yet another carcass. Apoc goes up on the ropes. Can find one, but can't sneak away. 3k for three on top of the box. Oh. This is usually a one and done, but it's an easy position to play because you have that rendezvous to get away. And well, you have Moose to just draw yeah. all of the attention in the world. Owl drone goes out and oh. takes Moose, but King goes undetected. And he rips three down. But they steal it right bleatly. And imagine how tilted Tig is going to be <laughs> if they don't get this round. But Mata has got a great position as well, and they might not be looking here. One enemy remaining. And he's inside the lockdown. Nobody's expecting somebody to be, th to be this far forward. As the lockdown subsides, Lin now has a tough task here. As the knives... No. Lin? Just walks One past all of them, picks up the kill on Tomata. Now in the 1v1, needs to do it again, but it's B-Dog. Pops onto the spike for just a moment. Now looking to go aggressive around the corner comes Lin, but he's only got 20 HP, and B-Dog rips it away oh, from him. Hi. And LG secure the round, so Tig's efforts are for not. Wow, what a cr Shields into this round with the Phantom, and I mean, that would be pretty unfortunate. Oh, the Cloud Burst, no way Lin can get the Whoa. knives out, and Tig does it again! 
goes good for three and P-Dog on the flank. Starts to go a little wild with it. Oh man, that is nuts from the chamber. 20 kills already. Operator that he's got in his hands. Shock dart won't land just yet. Viper's pit to get onto the site, but Tig still manages to find the frags. He's now looking for more. Oh. He'll find more. Give him the ace, baby. I think he's down one shot. The Dazzle will fall. The pit still stands. Apoth able to trade it back and again. Tig doing so much for his squad, but nobody else able to convert just yet. But the spike is still in hand. It has not left. been planted on the site, and the pit is still a problem. And it's, yeah, so close. Game of inches right here. Shots coming through into the Viper's pit. Hey, Bob, get a ball, B Dog. Picking up two, gonna be traded right back now in the 1v2, but the spike has to be planted. You're running out of time, and I think Retro might just get run down the backstab around the corner. And it's Moose to trample him down the stampede. And what a show. No, I, somebody texted me and, and called me a dummy because I said Moose is. But either way, I digress as things get a little shaky inside Garage. Renegades out to a great start. Lin and Roy pick up the first couple of kills. Working hand in hand with one another. And speaking of Moose, he's still inside the Nebula Smoke. He's trying to get a little crazy. And he actually finds Lin. So thank you very much, sir. I will back away from this one. It's Renegade still a player ahead. Moose on his way to buy a lottery ticket after that one. Nice uh, shot through the smoke, but Randy Savage is going to cover here. And uh, a very nice pistol round regardless from Renegades. The post plant is strong on the C site. And unless Moose can, you know, be basically become invisible, uh, not going to do much in this round. This B site, because three are here out towards A, means their numbers are spread thin elsewhere on the map. Is Retro gonna find a kill on the Tig? Nice little upgrade as well. Phantom down. Now Phantom in hand as that spike is planted. Your luminosity. You gotta get information. You have to do it quick. You also have to get into this site as Lin. Maybe a miss input there. Jumping up. Trying to get a little crazy. You can't jump and gun, but you can run and gun. As the numbers now start to dwindle on the opposite side of things, it's Renegades in a tough spot. Retro stuck inside the nebula smoke inside oh! the trailblazer he picks up two make it three on the round and this one looking that much more doable here for renegades but it's a sheriff in hand somebody has to peek and somebody has to get on the spike here it's all down to moose a headshot five hp you gotta get out and that's exactly the call as renegades have done it they've hung on and they've put three in a row as well as you might hope from the jet and this is another one there. It's a close call, but it's Mata to fall on the entry, and they're going straight into garage from here. They're trying to make it quick, but Dazzle won't allow it. Picks up the controller there with the Hunter Shuri. So good with that. B-Dog rights his wrongs. We'll find the next this time on the C side Ooh. as we go back and forth with the Hunter Shuri. Now the last one standing is across the map on the B side. It's Moose. That spike yet to be picked up, so angles still need to be cleared. As Lin holding the anger out, angle out towards the defender side, it's spawn, Lin. Thing of beauty from Renegades. Pulled this so, so well, they got a completely free sight. Yeah, Mata gets one, but still, a free plant. A pick on to Mata. And B-Dog needs to do a lot here with these knives. A lot of utility tossed out, but the spike does get planted. No matter. The lockdown used is going to be enough to push the defenders away. They might just push forward. That seems to be, at the very least, the TIG special. I don't know if that is going to be the LG special. Or the Renegade special, excuse me. The speed dog knives go wide. There's one more to play with. Okay, here we go. Now we've got ourselves around as LG looking Ooh. to make it thrifty. And B-Dog steps into the shoes and does so much more to secure the round for LG. Is everybody safe on the A site for now? Here comes Lin up and over the top and finds Dazzle, the one safe spot. Not safe any longer. Tig looks for something through the nebula smokes, but there's nothing to be found, and it's Renegade. One player ahead as Tig evens the odds. Nobody yet on the site, but the spike, it's delayed for just a moment. Is that enough time to really start to gather the thoughts as LG are now working against the clock? Yeah, I just can't peek into B-Dog here, but other than that, Renegades are basically able to just hold their positions. All the onus is obviously on Luminosity, and the Seekers are going to start it off. Mata. Off the back end of the Seekers, trying to push on through, but Lin sits down three on the round. Tig's able to grab him back. And now Moose 
a very tall task. It has to be the wide swing here from Apoth, and I don't know if he can actually spot the spike. Moose gonna find the kills now. Retro no. has to push up, needs to do it right here, right now. And we'll look to play that full five-man retake. Nice flash to assume that garage position. As Monaco's out on the swing, Floyd come out on top here in the first kill of the retake. Things aren't going too swimmingly for LG just yet. It's Moose. Now next up to the docket, they're just throwing bodies inside Garage. Moose does come out on top of Randy Savage, but it's only good for one. Dazzle has so much that he has right in front of him. Able to take down Lin. The clock is ticking. Roy's just on the other Ooh. side. Shots to the box will land, and the spike planted for long. Shouldn't be an issue here. It's all about damage. Name of the game once more, but it seems like that's all LG can find. They picked up one round, but it's... It's just Gishin will eventually peek out, you know, sussing out this this flank. But the timing is totally missed, Randy Savage, if he peeks out here. Nope, Tig oh. gets him. Okay, yeah, Tig comes back, doubles back, tries to find the killjoy, and does do just that, has that weapon at hand as well. Cosmic Divide comes on through, four stars going down, stun won't land, Dazzle with the run and gun, and the Spectre, Lin falls, and Renegade, things are starting to slip away, Roy the last one standing, sprays down one, but can't control it for the next, it's Mata, start, Dazzle finds a tag, unfortunately no kill this time around, Renegade's pushing onto the B site, the skies, I don't think there's ever a bad time to do it, there it is, we see that Cosmic Divide come through, should open up the A site, at least for the time being, meanwhile, to the spawn. The attacker side is spawn. It's Apoth to pick up Dazzle, who tried to play on the flank. Now everybody else coming from that defender side and spawn. And I think you're gonna know that down and and you know take playing the Astra. Um, Renegades, you know, got much got a much better deal out of that. They do go a little too far. They're trying to take these. And the moose wanted to be loose, but unfortunately the bird was the word. Oh my goodness, look at all the damage. Dazzle can't even escape through heaven. Hunter Shuri used to answer for the lockdown. Randy Savage creeps his way onto the site, crab walking to take down B-Dog. And Renegades, I mean, they just keep finding ways. Flashed and pushed onto the site, but nobody falls. Now take the last one standing. I mean, you just throw whatever you want at the Astra. At this point, this round is yours, Renegades. This time, it's only Tig remaining, and even with that kill, yeah, <laughs> gotta avoid the lockdown. While we see Tig make his way into the site and get flashed. And while we got some time put into an LG comeback, until it is, you know, winning past that bonus round, resetting yeah. Renegades once more. And Dazzle gets that spike down. Moose. It's just a couple out towards spawn. It's Linen Retro looking to play on the flank. Randy Savage reveals his one position and remaining. takes quite a bit of damage in doing so. Now the last one standing is completely flashed up and around to the side. They are sort of knowing this map isn't their playground quite as much as Icebox was. They are getting the plant here though. And it's going to be even on the retake of 4v4. This was that round where we had kind of stated you can start to put stock into the comeback, right? If you can pick up this bonus round, which LG's coming in with a couple of Spectres. Sure, they have some rifles, but you see that Marshall to take down the Owl Drone. This is where you could say, yeah, okay, they've started to get back into this one. Unfortunately, it looks like another round to go the way of Renegades unless Moose can be sneaky once more and get something done. Retro gonna hop onto the spike. Lynn gonna hop onto the box. And we'll find that kill. So one of those weird things, though, where... We see the team that's six rounds ahead on pistols win. And it's not just pistols yeah. now, it's Lin with the Blade Storm. So it feels weird thinking that LG take this round or secure this round for free. It's obviously not going to be that. Lin looking to go up top over the Nebula Smoke. And I mean, it just doesn't matter. Dash onto the site. Retro the next to fall. Oh my god, Mata having himself a grand old time. We saw a nice play from Mata there. We need him in gun rounds as well. Mata is a fragger on this team. You it's time to put it. up the frags. Renegades, though, get aggressive. Already open up in the round. Things have, have flipped, at the very least, for B-Dog. He was out on the A site. Unfortunately, doesn't get much with it. Meanwhile, corner. Are they privy to this? They're a little oh. upset. No way, Roy. What are you doing, pal? <laughs> Aim punched him and took him down. That's gorgeous there. From Roy, and that's a good start, but 
We got more. We don't have any more. We don't have any more at all. Don't seem long for this world. I'm not gonna say it, Tanner. I'm just gonna leave it, let it hang in the air. Because renegades look like they are taking us to a third map here. What you're saying, what I heard, was there's no way renegades lose this. LG out. I don't want to get too far ahead of myself. They got a couple of ultimates to play with, but no it's upgraded pistols for the most part. And Moose, okay, baby, retro. Biting off more than he can chew as Moose opens up this round. Oh, oh no. Okay. No. no. <laughs> Two here now with Randy Savage low. With the position revealed, the Seekers will go in. Randy Savage is somehow, someway still alive. Finally, he's going to be taken down in oh, Renegades. Okay. They're putting together a round, and with those kills coming through LG, they're looking to beat feet out towards the C site for Apoth. Waiting. Ready for a push out this way. Expecting to. This will is leap so away. Good. Looking to play slow. And one of two ultimates still online for Renegades. That being the Cosmic Divide. Apoth completely undetected. And there's only 20 seconds. You have to make C your final destination. No way. Will Apoth peek it? Spike He's just planted. waiting. He's playing all three. Disciplined. I like this. Plenty, plenty of discipline. Look at Roy. Roy used that Trailblazer all the way from spawn yeah. just in case. <laughs> Wanted to catch somebody looking to get aggressive. Now Apoth, his position has been noted. Roy was low oh. HP, but he's not even in the conversation. It's Lin instead, and it's Renegades. I think that snake bite might have missed. Oh no, the dash right into it. Was that snake bite actually perfect? Moose, okay, I mean, just absolutely huge brain, unfortunately, only picked up one kill, his team has made his way through the teleporter, is now trying to find something more, the health bars, they're getting pretty low on the side of Renegades, but the bodies aren't dropping, and that's what matters, because there it is, Roy, drop another of his own, a nice guiding light to spot out B-Dog, and it's exploding, this is the TIG special, just to sit inside the nebula smoke, looking to do it again, and he's able to find the kill, he was looking at the ground, how did he manage to find the flick back to the head, he was trying to re-smoke that nebula, and well, he goes one for one, that's the best that you could hope for, Zaypoth pushes his way through U-Haul, finds another onto the site, and it's Renegades, although we've been back and forth for a second, they're starting to peel ahead, the spike not to be delayed as retro, I don't want to do too, anything too crazy. Not really their round to, to be crazy. Fortunately, Randy Savage, a couple yeah. hundred credits here, a couple hundred credits there, like slowly chipping away at the utility that Renegades have. Sure, when you give the kills back over to Roy, he's going to have that Trailblazer on V4. So at the very least, LG in quite possibly the best possible situation oh, to continue yeah. to do damage. They've got everybody here on this site. Cosmic. Left. Let's see what the, sh what the sheriffs can do if they continue to ring through in that. They will. Mata. To pick up the next that spike yet to be planted as Apoth is able to grab one back and TIG. TIG around oh, just narrowly misses the timing. Fortunately, Dazzle's already on the rotation. He's gonna be here. You just gotta try and stall if you can. Nice grab well, but pulls him right into range to find the kill. How does he and get now that? Lin in such a tough spot. That should not have happened, but it did. We're here now in LG looking to make a statement. In this round, sure, three in a row. Does it stop here? Is Dazzle not ready for the push out towards elbow? Is Lin ready for TIG? Yes, he is. Yeah, he's gonna find something. Oh, nope. You had to say something? Oh, the caster curse. He found it. He, he, he found there, something. Yeah, he found it. That's yeah, <laughs> true. You're not, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. He did find something. That isn't what he wanted to find. Unfortunately, that is not hidden and buried treasure. It was a turtle shell. And uh, it was rotting and absolutely disgusting. It's not the way you want to jump into that next round. Your next buy round as that is Renegades just have this luminosity squad completely red here. Dazzle. You just got to go down on your shield here, buddy. There's no way out. Astra would be a bit slower than everybody else, but Apoth proving the exact opposite. And with that plant, we go Viper's Pit on the site. Seekers for information, but how much can you get there? You're still blind as you push on through. Lin going to throw out a couple of knives, only find some damage. Oh, just shoot through the wall. You would have gotten the kills. Obviously, hindsight, 2020, and we do have walls, unlike these players. But you don't need walls to know that Moose is in a very scary spot.
not able to find the cars with timings. Everything about Astra is very difficult to play. She's one of the highest skill ceilings of any agent in the game. B Dog to open up on Lin, though, that's a huge find. <laughs> Meanwhile, Modest got two flashes of his own. Randy Savage around the corner and B Dog picks up three. Give him the ace, baby. B Dog looking to go off and get LG on the board. Around the corner comes Retro. There's the trade. Picks up one and now needs to find some more. And yeah, they just left B Dog out to dry as Retro picks up two for himself. Roy trying to help him out, but he doesn't get out in time. It's now Roy all by his lonesome. And 1v2 needs to go clutch to keep them undefeated here. As Dazzle spots him out. Shock Dart won't land. There's the swing. Look. Or outcome, I should say, in that first look. And, oh, there's a great start once more. Uh, but Dazzle, unfortunately, goes missing after going fishing. Nice shots into the pit. And this right here is just something you don't want to fathom this. You're thinking, are you serious? You're shooting me through this. Are you serious? You're putting a shock dart at my feet? Retro with a huge round and moose. You're playing with fire here, baby. Pushes out, finds Randy Savage, tries to sneak away, does so. The Viper's pit will stand on the B site still. They are all so close to each other. This Viper's pit has so much impact. But Moose gets unseated there as Roy is traded out. When the op gets taken down, Dazzle now has to try and hang on. Unfortunately, there's only 12 seconds, Wes. There's only 12 seconds. Make it 10. Four seconds on the clock. That's Spike. Fake plant. Now Retro has to stick it, and Tig might just run him down. He's going to have the backstab. No. And two players on site, they're, they're in a very difficult position. They need to... Andy Savage pushed way deep here into the spawn. You have to be ready for this. You have to be ready for this. Oh, Dazzle spotted him out. Yep, Dazzle takes him down. You absolutely have to expect that, especially... Randy Savage oh, being the lurker on this. Oh, oh my god, Dazzle just oh my god. it to him. Four kills, quick six. Things giving it to him if that isn't. Oh, back and forth with the Hunter's Fury. Nothing landing just yet, but B-Dog instead. Mm. Oh, there it is. Okay, B-Dog answered, and Roy will find another. Tig has also been a huge thorn for this Renegades roster, but it's looking like Moose might be that player this time around. Still inside the showers. As he peeks on out, he'll find Lin. Now looking for more Dazzle. A familiar position. Pop the grip. This is how we get it started. This is how we start to iron things out. Roy pushing forward. I don't think they're expecting that many. B-Dog picks up two, make it three as Apoth. It's traded back, and it's LG one player ahead here in the pistol, and you're in a bit better of a position if you're LG. It's not 10-2 to 2 at the half anymore. Yeah. You pick up this one and the next, and you're only trailing by two rounds, but Retro... Oh, no, I was talking about Thorn in the side, and Retro's being exactly that. Around the corner comes Randy Savage and Dazzle. Okay, crispy. We need to see it. Oh, unfortunately, takes his eyes off the prize. A little quiet in this series has given RNG a way in. Oh, and he's after this. Runs him down, guns him down, gets healed up. Now wants some more. Hungry for the frags is B Dog. It's Tig. And they get out, just get out on sight here. Whoa, wait. A couple of Vipers having their own little 1v1. Yeah, that's tough. Uh, Moose, what are you doing there, man? Moose, what are you doing there, man? Let him have You gotta be perfect, buddy. Unfortunately, now he has to rely on those Spectre. Dash away from Lin, but... Here comes the stun. Mm -hmm. oh, He's able to get it back, oh, fortunately. Nice flash. Dazzle, usually good for something here. Maybe finds a bit of damage. And a trade for them. LG got so much map control off of that. Now, can they use it with Retro? Last player standing. Quite a bit of damage. This is doable. Roy needs to find the first one. But he will not. Moose. Close. Get a little abstract, maybe. Yeah, abstract. Definitely. Definitely the word for it. Fortunately. No way, Dazzle. Yeah, no way, it? man. Magnetized, not fair. Magnetized. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. And although they don't get that first pick for... That's bad timing for that wall to go down. Fortunately, those nebula smokes go up and retro. Yep, stays alive. Model on low HP. Should they be able to find a couple of body shots that way or maybe send some through the smoke? It could even the odds. But it's an extra player here on the map for LG. And I don't mean that would have been the answer. Unfortunately, Lin can't and he can't even sneak away. The opera pot doesn't quite hit the shot, but now Mata is so... Oh! <gasps> Apoth finishes the job he started. Mata gets decapitated on the A site. And 
Now, what do you do? The teleporter comes through, but there's presence on B, Tanner. Yeah, they didn't budge. They, they hardly budged. If anything, now you're out of time. Cosmic Divide to come on through. We don't even get to see the Hunter Shiri, unfortunately, because Retro's dead, but the round secured. A timeout. Uh, maybe LG thought that Renegades were still in the timeout because they wasted so of this luminosity attack. Off angle here. Not the Oh yet. no. Backs away. And I believe a teleporter will look to back away, but here go LG on the hunt. No, 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 no. <laughs> Apoc. Okay. Gravity well huge. Nova Pulse off the back end. Able yeah, to take away one weapon. Can't find the next, but Tin goes down to the spike. So damage dealt. Can Roy handle a smoke? See if he can get down for another one. Mata. Is Mata just a debuff? Always on 70 health. A couple of body shots from the Spectre. Able oh. to find it. And Apoc picks up two. Backs away with the weapon upgrade. And out towards the A side. Savage from this position, but that snake bite just doesn't cover it all. So Randy Savage still able to peek him there. Moose, though. Not done just yet. Surely not. Surely not. You have no time. There's absolutely no way. Okay, here we go. On the swing goes mm. Retro. Close. Gives RNG the lead once again. Daz Dazzle. Hello? He, has he missed a single... Has he popped hard under Fury a single time where he's missed all three? I don't think so. No, I think the one time that we saw it, it was because his teammate killed the person. So right, Mata takes him up hit. first. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah, but Mata stole the kill, so he's been pretty perfect with that ultimate and oh, the confidence they use the owl drone they spot out mod and they look to push right on into the pit no way retro's done it takes down viper the pit will fall a 2v3 directly on the site as one comes through inside retro the retro continues to push forward it's four on the round but they have to find more they're running out of time the recon bolts it won't land for the ping as Dazzle. Now the last one standing in the 1v1 and clutches it out. We're all knotted up. From LG. Every attack. Waiting for this kind of push. Dazzle to punish. Cosmic Divide. Gonna cut off the left side of the site. One still yet to be used. No way. Renat, yes he does. As the wall goes down, three are standing there. Watching and waiting as Retro falls onto the site. It's all up to Randy Savage. The Viper mm. that teleported away. 12 Hits. seconds on the clock. Oh my god, they're really getting down to the wire. They're gonna toss it over to Mata to get the Seekers online. <laughs> they don't check this way. This, that's so scary. The spike gets planted and Randy said he gets some more at the end to just stay alive. But he manages to do so. But what do they bring into this one, Wes? It is. Mm. Again, it's a yard sale buy. It's sticks and stones. You're driving down the street. You see the sign. You have some cash on you. It's staying put out towards A. Renegade's not coming up too much just yet. Hunter Fury is available. Here come the Nebula Smokes. The Flash is out as well. One gonna be given right back, but B-Dog just opens up the site. The Judge shots go wide. It all came down to this as the Hunter Fury looks to scoop up something, but they've just got nothing to work with. His A-Pop gets shipped away at jumping around the corner. Now Retro, the last one standing. 